Hello, I'm Jennifer, and welcome back to the Forest Parlor. Halloween is near, the full moon is rising, and no one likes to be stuck without any plans on Halloween. So this year, it is perfect to stay home, light some candles, and try a spell or two that is specifically recommended to do on Halloween night. Everything from love and luck spells, divining the future, and communicating with ghosts. Halloween night is so dark and mysterious and magical, you can't help but feel compelled to join in on something festive and spirity. Well, here are a few activities steeped in tradition for you to try on Halloween night, if you dare. <laughs> Need a question answered? Put St. John's wort, basil, and rosemary and simmer them in a cauldron and set your intention. Focus on the steam that rises and look for patterns, shapes, and symbols. Or scry by gazing into the gently bubbling liquid. If you've never scryed before, it might sound a little more challenging than it really is. Really just unfocus your vision as you continue to stare, but keep your mental focus, right? And from there, kind of get a little daydreamy and relax a little bit as you seek your answer. Let visions come to you without mentally analyzing it too much. You don't want to get in your own way. Do you specifically want to know who you're going to marry in the future? On Halloween night at midnight, sit in front of a candlelit mirror and eat an apple. A vision of your future spouse will appear behind you. If a skull appears behind you instead, it means you will die before you get to the altar. So there's that. Would you like to invite a ghost in? Hold a dumb supper. Traditionally served on Halloween, this is a dinner for you and a ghostly guest. Do not speak during the meal. Be receptive to everything that happens as you eat your dinner. When you're done with your dinner, clear the table and clean up. This hopefully will trigger the ghosts to depart. Feeling like the ghosts are a little too restless around you? Burying apples at a crossroads on Halloween night is said to feed hungry ghosts, pacifying them so that they can rest more easily. But maybe it's your heart that's more restless this year. Write down all your romantic aspirations on a piece of paper Fold that paper in some dragon blood resin and then toss it into the fire on Halloween night for your true love to come to you. Burning an orange and a black candle on Halloween night and letting them burn out naturally is said to ensure a year of good luck. But if that sounds like a fire hazard, on Halloween night, bob for apples with your loved ones. Make sure everyone gets an apple, and everyone should eat their apple entirely afterwards to ensure their year of good luck. Or how about trying something just a little more daring to get a wish granted? On Halloween night, stand naked in front of a mirror with only a single candle lit. Don't worry, it'll be flattering. Make your wish and then be sure not to speak until morning. So there you go. I hope you found an idea or two on something you can do on Halloween this year. Thank you so much for spending your October with me. I very much enjoy doing these videos. So please like, share, comment, and subscribe because those things really help support this channel and I appreciate it so much. Everyone stay safe, have a wicked fun Halloween, and visit me again in the forest parlor. Happy Halloween!